Good morning! I'm Polarized Moon, and welcome to Casual Friday, the day where I play casual games in casual clothes. Today I'm playing What Never Was. Um, it's a, I guess it's a short, first-person, puzzle, story-driven game. It's been a while since I've played one of these on Casual Friday, and these are some of my favorite types of games to play on Casual Friday. Just these short, like, get in, get engrossed in a story, and then get out. <laughs> I mean, I don't, there's a lot of games I don't want to get out of because I think they're so cool. But we'll get in, we'll see what this one's all about. Um, we'll just make, check the options, make sure. Subtitles, yes. Yeah, okay, okay, we're all good. Oh, this is controller support? Uh, first person games, I like to use mouse and keyboard. New game. <clears throat> hey, Mom, where are you? Wait, what? So you're not coming? But I'm already here. I know, but Mom, don't we owe it to Grandpa to... Yeah, I know, it's just... What? You can't sell the clock? Grandpa's had uh, that for years. So Grandpa passed away. Okay, okay. And they're gonna go through his stuff. Got it. I can just start clearing out my boxes and then... I don't know. We can come back tomorrow and do the rest? Yeah, bye. All right, that makes sense. Uh, it's a pretty pretty standard opening for one of these types of games. All right, what do we got? Oh, hi. I'm really going to miss you, Grandpa. All right, let's do this. Ah, that's one of the uh, that 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 looks like half of the logo to the game. Oh, look at that. Oh, it looks like a little bit of a broken texture over there. That's fine. Uh, I have always loved the British countryside. Britain, cool. Okay, what is? Oh, that's just a reflection. Okay. Uh, it's going to take forever to sort through all these uh, Celtic myths and legends. Oh, cool. Luna would love this game. Ah, uh, the old gramophone. It looks like a torn out page. Of what? Oh, you picked up a journal page. Cure tab. Uh, it seems no... <clears throat> oh, journal page number two. Should I find num journal page number one and read these in order? I don't know. Well, we'll, we'll do this. Cell phone. A Matson flip phone. It's a year old, but still works pretty great. Not in a hurry to upgrade, even though the new smartphones look pretty nifty. And maybe it would be... I would be if I could afford one. <laughs> Student ID. Ah, okay. Sarah Elizabeth Wright. Not sure, quite sure if studying bo botanics and biology is right for me, and God knows mom doesn't think so. But I like nature, and I like the idea of maybe one day fixing the planet and winning a Nobel Prize or something. Or setting up a flower shop. You know, whichever. Also not the pic best picture, but yeah, that's me. Necklace I got from Grandpa when I turned 10. He joked it was magical and it would keep me safe from monsters and such under my bed. And I believed him for the longest time. For it since, and now that he's gone, I don't think I'll ever stop wearing it. Aw, that's, that's cute. It seems no coincidence that both the resting pace of Pele and the Paracaca would happen to be in the mountains. The trek, the trek has gone well. Uh, the trek has gone well, and although the winds are ominous, my clothing and necessities have carried me well so far. The guide I hired upon my arrival have, has proved invaluable, not only in the knowledge of the thick forest, but for his rich knowledge and company. Not unexpectedly, the symbol of water could be found at the peak of the summit along with the alchemic symbol of water. Oh, okay, both water, okay. So this is the symbol of water, and the alchemic symbol of water is the upside-down triangle with the, the line on it. Um, I know a little bit of alchemy symbols, so maybe maybe that'll help me in my... Yeah, yeah, this, yeah the upside-down triangle with the little thingy on it. Uh, again, these symbols seem interconnected. Well, one set are alchemic symbols known to many people. The other seem to be strange of no cultural design, at least that I am knowledgeable of. The encounter in Hawaii makes me certain that the other two elements must bear significance as well. What will I find on this mountain? Okay, cool. Oh man, you walk really slow. Oh, hello. A desk drawer. Oh, can I actually like? Nah, I don't feel like reading up on kings, countries. Yeah. <laughs> Enough of that. Okay, so I can interact with. By Brian Froud. His books are all so old. <laughs> hey, wait. Is that the biography of George Lucas? <laughs> uh, that's really funny. Oh, Grandma's cello. So this is where it ended up. Ah, nice. I really wish I knew if that was in tune or not. A desk drawer. 
A desk drawer. A desk. A desk. A desk. A desk drawer. A desk drawer. It's locked. It's locked. It's locked. It's locked. It's locked. It's locked. It's 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 locked. Okay. An open desk drawer. An open desk drawer. An open desk drawer. Let's see if I can find the missing pages before moving this. Oh, Grandpa's old travel diary. Seems like a few pages are missing. It's a magnifying glass. <laughs> For magnifying things. I like you. You're great. It's a banker's lamp. Cool. She, I, I love this character. She's great. The Hero with a Thousand Faces by Joseph Campbell. A tape recorder. Hello. This is Howard James Wright with a message for my granddaughter. Oh, look at that. Sarah Elizabeth Wright. The game by Aki Halgren. So Aki Halgren? Aki? I don't know how to pronounce that. Start off immediately, please. <laughs> <laughs> Michaela Gilchrist. Uh, Oof, scarred. To this, then it means, well, it means I'm gone. Aww. But I don't want you to be too sad about it. That's just the way life goes sometimes. So, chin up, my little pixie. Remember our grand moments. All the adventures we had when you were a little one and I wasn't such a cranky old man. I... I know you have questions for me. It's true I kept secrets from you and your mother. But there were good reasons. There are things in this world. Uh -huh. than ourselves and I the god Pele, the goddess of fire. I didn't want either of you to face the dangers that I've had to... I never wanted to place such a burden on your shoulders, but now it, it's unavoidable. Uh-oh. Pixie, I need your help. But I can't just tell you. I have to show you. You will need to see for yourself. Okay. What do I need to see for myself? This world is full of secrets. From the tallest tree to the deepest river. In every breath of wind and every dancing flame. All you have to do is look. Goodbye, Sarah. Is that a quote I from a book? Very much. Look at that bump mapping on that globe. Oh, look, and N60 and uh, NAA. Oh man, my old A station. <laughs> I spent hours playing games on this thing. Damn, the adapter's missing. Probably for the best. <laughs> I wouldn't get anything done today if I started playing. What do you What do you got in there? Uh, hold on. I want to see. There's, okay, Banjo Kazooie. Uh, looks like well, it's it's something not Banjo Kazooie. Meridia, Mer Merida. Uh, I don't know what that one's a. I don't know what that one's a parody of, but that one next to it's Star Fox 64. But it looks like Flight Wolf 32. There's Goldeneye, I think. That's hilarious. Wait, how am I? Oh, I, I guess I got stuck in there. Sarah's things. Hey, Mr. Piggles. Aw. Uh, okay, so I guess I'm supposed to find it's things. A landscape painting of Whittington. I am not taking this with me right now. It's a landscape. I am not taking this with me right now. My grandfather's grandfather clock. How much room? <laughs> <laughs> it's locked. There is no way I can- Grandpa loved this thing. Told me it was one of a kind. Although, he never actually told me why. There's alchemist symbols on it. Um... Okay. It's a chessboard. With the game already in progress, there's no one to play. And... I'm not sure I even know the proper rules. Okay, looks like we've got another note here. Could this be one of the diary pages? D Journal page number one. I finally landed on Hawaii and will be soon my arduous climb of Mauna Loa. I'm not much of a climber, but I am filled with determination. I will, however, take some... I will, however, first take some days to recuperate from the very tiresome travel from which my fear of flights did not exactly improve. Not only was the pilot rude and dismissive of safety protocol, he also seemed to be completely unsure at times of what he was doing. Regardless, I am here. And we'll spend the coming days of the village of Pahala 
of whatever secrets of Pele, goddess of fire, holds now within my grasp. Definitely reached that right place, although I am weary to travel. Weary from travel, I am too excited to sleep. The villagers are friendly, but warn me of hurting customs, something I have no intent to do. I also noticed the alchemic symbol of fire etched over people's doorways. Connects to Pele, of course, but it is linked to the crest I saw so well. That's the triangle with the dangle at the bottom. Uh, yeah, right there. Man, I, I should really pay attention to what what's going on here. Celtic myths and legends. A typewriter. Fairies. By Brian Froud. Hiking by train. I'm leaving by train. An old bicycle. <laughs> Does this globe have anything to do with Grandpa's message? Oh, hello. Hey, this is that goddess thing mentioned in Grandpa's diary. And Pele. Oh, okay. These can be... No, that's not it. Oh, there's an order. Okay, so... That doesn't seem to be it. What did the message say again? Okay, what message? Uh, in every breath of wind and every dancing flame. That, could he be referring to these symbols? Okay. Breath of wind, every dancing flame, that'd be this, fire. No, that's not it. Okay, hold on. So it's... Few Sang China, and a symbol of a tree. Yes. Ah, uh, shoot. Nope, I, I can get this. Okay, it's not fire, so it's got to be water, and then, okay, got it. Yeah. Cool. I did it. This looks like, is this a second part of my necklace? Ah, interesting. Yeah, there, there's the logo of the game when I downloaded it. Oh, that's cool. The necklace part. It's an old table lamp. Oh, is that a key? Small key. Cool. Okay, does that go to the lamp or something? So look at that. Press V. Whoa. Serious whoa. Oh, hello. What do we got over here? Fire, wind. Okay, got it. Uh, okay. I, I, I understand. Okay. So I'm going to have to attach those somehow does this key open one of these oh it opens all of these oh hold on this seems to belong to hmm. what's this journal photograph an old photograph found in grandpa's desk it says sultan hassan mosque Madras, uh egypt 1966 must have been for one of his trips oh i can spin these around cool journal page number four uh, all I've worked for, it's here. I know it. The necklace in the temple in China made all the difference. Now I'm finally in Africa, hoping to set the burning sensation of curiosity to peace. The symbols line up and my calculations were correct. The anonymous mail I received helped on a grand scale, but I've not managed to figure out the center. Sender. Shush, I can read. Shush, shush. Regardless, uh, the last piece of knowledge should be here, in Egypt. And after evading my... And after having evaded my guide, I've now found the symbols. It's time to learn time to learn what is behind these strange con connections and events. Okay. Here we go. Uh Oh, hello. A pretty fancy look. Nah. I can find my way back to the train station without it. That's a really nice binocular. <laughs> Monocular? Yes. This will be perfect for my next sail <laughs> across the seven seas, but I'll leave it where it is for now. Okay, there's the last journal page. An open desk drawer. Oh, can I, can I talk about the open pencils? Oh, hello. There's something there. Alright, let's read this one. Journal page three. The alchemic symbol of Earth combined with the Chinese one for tree. Okay. Okay. Uh, while the trip has yet to sail, has yet again gone well, my research has once again led me to these symbols. I can draw no conclusion. I have spent most of my life researching these mythological connections, and yet again I reach my destination and nothing, almost as if all an extremely elaborate prank. I sometimes wonder if my daughter is right. Months of, nay, years of planning, only to eventually find a temple or shrine with another symbol, another riddle, and another clue. 
However, at the same time, it feels like I'm so close to finding something. Summit. Uh, okay, so... I believe I now have all the information I need to do that puzzle over there. Oh, crap. These books are all so old. Hey, Is there anything else I need to see? Anything out here I can look at? Anything... Oh, there seems to be something... Glowing over there? Oh, in this drawer. Hello? Journal page? I thought that- I thought I got all- Oh! Elfston! Also sometimes known as Trollstones, the subject of Scandinavian folklore, normal, normal locks with holes in them, but- the, Normal rocks with holes in them about the size of an acorn were considered lucky. Otherworldly and useful. Hung from the necks of livestock, it would protect them and their farmers for alike from malicious predators, trolls, and even incubi. Some tales of the owner of True Elfston also be able to see the otherwise invisible common troll through the hole of the rock. While several of these were on display, only one of them looked to be the one I was looking for, carved in a way that was no average jeweler could, and with ore in the place of where a hole should be. I didn't acquire it through the most honest of means, but no one came to harm, and I'm sure its disappearance won't be noticed. I do wonder how it fits into all this, though. I must study it thoroughly. Okay, so I've got an elf stone. Okay. Alright, I want to see if there's anything else I need to do before I can get up to this lamp. Or this clock. Did I just hear a dog barking? No? Okay, it looks like I have to do the clock thing now. Whatever, whatever this is. Uh. Hmm. Come to think of it, I. Hmm. The key I have doesn't fit here. Okay. It weighs like I can't believe Mom wants to sell this. I get that he missed a lot of her childhood, but come on. Whoa. This looks like it belongs in a museum. Nah. -uh. I've watched too many movies to go about stealing ancient relics. All right. Am I missing a key somewhere? I seem to be missing something. So I got whatever- I got this thing from that. Um... Maybe there's... No, I'm not seeing any more glowy bits. The glowing thing did seem to lead me towards... All this stuff. Maybe there's a, uh... Oh, this thing! That's right! Oh, wait a second! Huh. It's locked. It's locked. What was the- what was the- it said to get a closer look at something it was like- It's locked. What could the combination be? Okay, Grandpa. I need a clue to unlock this box. I think I have the clue. Yeah, here we go. Guess I'll have to work it out myself. Then. Pixie. It's Pixie. Oh! Oh, you can't see them. Oh, that's interesting. Fancy key. Okay, cool. I got the key. Collector. Okay, that clearly goes to this. Okay. Alright, so I need to put the symbols in their locations. So... Was it V? Alright. Uh, oh, I can't see... Alright, so... Let's do... Fire... I this hand is a triangle facing outwards. Oh, wait, can I not? Oh, I have to do... Okay, I, ha I guess I have to do tree first. Uh, that's down. That's where that other one is. Oh! Oh, that's how I do it. Okay. It's stuck in place. It's stuck in place. Okay, let's move the other one quick. There we go, because I believe tree needs to go there. Um, and then this is fire. So fire needs to go up there. Yes. No, one more. All right. And then water goes here at it won't budge. right there. And then wind 
goes up over here. Was that it? Yeah! yeah I got it! Perfect! Oh, that's cool. Okay, so, oh, did, did she just get teleported out of here? What happened? That was the first time I traveled by magic, pulling at the thread that would unravel my grandfather's mysteries. Okay. I so wish he told me sooner, so we could have gone Aww. on at least one adventure together. Instead, I went on his adventure. The one that never was. Oh, what that never is was. A longer story. For another time. Never was. Wait, is that it? Oh, I was just getting invested into that. Oh no! <laughs> I want more. Oh, is there is there a long is there more of this game? Is there is there a is there a, a sequel or Oh man, that was great. Okay, well, Man, I really liked that! Oh, it was cool! And I'm glad I kind of knew a little bit about the alchemist symbols, so I didn't have to... I, I would assume that people don't who don't know the alchemist symbols would have to check those papers every single time. But no, that was really cool! I loved that! Oh, man, I, I'm gonna have to check. I'm gonna have to... If there's, like, a full game of this, I'm gonna have to go play it. I'm gonna have to find it and play it, because this is this was great. I loved it. Alright, good night. That's about all the time I've got for this episode. Like and subscribe if you like the episode. Ring that bell if you'd like to see more. If there's any other games you'd like to see me play on Casual Friday, post a comment in the in the post post about it in the comments below. I'll re I'll I'll read it, I'll consider. Good night, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye bye!